Okay, so we have to make mommy lunch because she's gonna be working eleven to eight tonight and she's gonna be hungry. So we're gonna be making her a salami sandwich today. First we'll do the salami and then we'll do the sides. Yeah, I'll put this back. We've gotta kinda of hurry because she's going to work. We're going to start with the mustard, okay? I'm going to shake it up a little bit so it's not watery. Oh, a little, just a little. That's all we want, really. So we're going to try to spread this evenly everywhere. Mmm, that smells pretty good. Yeah, so that'll be enough. I'll grab some Swiss cheese. Swiss cheese has this, these kind of like holes in them. Let's see. So we're going to do this and try to get up to this. It's kind of tough. Coming out, see the holes in them? We're going to give her one slice of that. That'll be enough. Get back this bag. Then we'll come over here and get some salami. Publix. Deli hard salami. And we're going to put some of that on there. And what I like to do is I like to take the salami off. See the thin slices. And I like to come over here and I like to press them down like this. And fold them up. Because it just, I like the bite of it. It chews better and it comes, comes off the sandwich better, so we we'll mash that down a little bit. And I don't, there's four slices. I might go with, let's see, one more. That's it. Thin slice, real thin slice. And then we'll close it. Just like so. We will put the salami back in the bag and in the fridge. But first, we'll just leave it here. I'm sort of in a hurry. Because i got to come over here. And I've got to grab a knife. And Mommy, instead of... She likes it cut triangular from each end. That's how she likes hers cut. I like mine cut this way. Parallel. But anyways, we're going to grab one of these Ziploc bags. Oh, okay. We'll grab a Ziploc bag. Okay. We got these at the dollar store. So, they're going to cost us $8. <clears throat> Put it snug in the bag, just like so. Okay, leave a little air in there so the sandwich doesn't get mashed up. I'm going to grab another one of these and come over here and I'll pick the salt and vinegar chips. She likes them every now and then. She doesn't like them all the time. Nice little snack for lunch. Okay. We'll leave a little air on that one. We'll come over here. <clears throat> and so we'll give her a bag of these Oreo minis. So she has some Oreo minis. Next, since she's in the shower right now, we, I am going to make her a bagel with cream cheese. So we're going to come over here, we're going to grab a 
have the bagels. Oh, there they are. Onion bagels. Onion flight lenders. Onion bagels. Oh, I forgot. We have to toast the bagel, so while we're toasting the bagel, we'll be right back. That means you cut it off while it's toasting. We're going to come over here to the fridge. I'm going to grab some cream cheese. This cream cheese is really good on bagels. First, I'm going to add a little bit of butter to it, and then the cream cheese. So, let's get the cream cheese out. Cream cheese is delicious. But Shane doesn't like it. Not yet. Probably when he gets older, he's going to like it. I knew it was going to rain. So, we're going to set this over here. We are going to get a piece of tin foil right here. I also got this from the dollar store, which is pretty cool. Their little, uh, oops, we got to like feel that. Oh. Let's see how we have the individual. These were a dollar too. I love it. So we're gonna pull one out. Hopefully one comes out. Yep. Perfect size for for a bagel. Put that back in there. Yeah. Lay that down like that. I'm gonna put the tin foil down like that. And then we're going to come over here. We're going to take a paper towel so she has something to wipe off her hands. We're going to sit it on the tin foil. Okay. We're going to pop this up. Okay. Now I want to get, oh, I want to get this side toasted, not the other side. So I'm going to press bagel. And it's going to cook it on one side. And so we'll wait for that and we'll be right back with you with the video.